Welcome to Tech Brothers. In this video, we're going to answer a question, what exactly merge replication is? Well, merge replication, as you know, the replication, if you read the structure of the replication, if you uh, know the architecture of replication, in replication, the server that gives the data um, is called publisher. And the server that receives the data is called subscriber. In merge replication, what happened is the data gets merged. Any change happen on sub sub subscriber side will uh, be replicated to publisher side, and anything happen to the uh, uh, publisher side will get replicated to subscriber side. So it data gets merged uh, back and forth between publisher and uh, subscriber. In this scenario, anyway, the, there is a distributor. Distributor is an agent for publisher and uh, 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 subscriber. So when we configure merge replication, sometimes the publisher um, you need to configure uh, as its uh, 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 own subscriber as well, because when it receives the data, it becomes subscriber. And when it gives the data, it becomes publisher. So same thing with the other side. Uh, it ha it needs to be publisher and subscriber at the same time. However, the distributor that's sitting in between them, which distributes the data, it knows that, uh, okay, something happened on left side of the, uh, let's say, on, on, on Europe side that needs to be uh, uh, merged with the New York side uh, in America, and something happened to the data in America that needs to be merged back to Europe. So data remains sync with a little bit of latency. It's not 100% right, but with a little bit of latency, the data remains sync, sync between source and destination. So that is what exactly merge replication is. I hope it helps.